This area has been farmed for hundreds of years. Um, and so uh, there's, there's great benefit and value in what's here. How can I improve it? And you know, hopefully when my kids take over the farm, I've got better ground than what I'm standing on now. It, everything is yield driven. Everything is economic driven. So this no-till is making economic sense or we wouldn't be going down this road. We would have to abandon this road if it weren't um, paying off for us by making us more efficient, leaner, meaner, using less resources to produce more crops. You know, we really have a, uh, a system that's working and we're, we're actually helping the environment. With continuous no-till, we spend half the time on the tractors we used to. We're spending a lot more time with our families. We're farming the same amount of land or more land in less time and making, making more money. We were working our soil, and I kind of concluded that we were just beating our soil to death. And now you can take a shovel or a spade out in the fields, and, and you can dig, and there's you can not always find earthworm passages. Uh, the, the soil just just has a, a structure to it that it didn't have before. And you got to remember, the soil is alive. That's what it is. <laughs> it's nothing but an organism. It's a living thing, pretty much. And you need to feed it just like you do any other thing that you raise in that field. There are just so many benefits. I don't even I don't even know where you would stop at. You know. Even if I had to pay you to let me plant no-till, I would plant no-till, you know? So that's the way it is. More and more farmers all across Virginia are making the switch to soil building, continuous no-till systems. These farmers are cutting costs and saving time by planting all of their crops year in and year out without tillage. They're also maximizing the soil benefits that come with less disturbance by adding in cover crops crop rotation, and other practices. As diverse as they are, one thing these farmers all have in common, they tell us that they are gaining ground.